Hi guys, welcome to HealthSpectra.com. 10 Ways to Stop Eating Too Much Sugar Sugar is an essential part of our diet, isn't it? But, the question that many fail to get answers to is whether or not the same even has positive impacts on our body. Studies and researchers around suggest that the same is not very healthy and effective for the body. Why is that so? Sugar is not just loaded with harmful calories, but is also potent to make steep rises in the sugar levels in the body, thus ending up causing insulin resistance with persistent levels around the same. Is there a way to manage the situation? There are actually a number of ways in which one can cut down their sugar intake. The only factor to ensure is that you abide by the tips closely and don't let any kind of cheats in. Cut down the sweetened beverages. It goes without saying that the sweetened beverages that most of us reach out for is one of the primary reasons that your body is not feeling well. The high fructose levels in them are bad for the body, especially for diabetics. Know what is right. Once many hear about the health effects of too much sugar, the first instinct of many is to wash out everything from the diet. That is not how everything works. In order to get your answer to how to stop eating lots of sugar, it is important for you to ensure that you educate yourself in this matter and make yourself aware. Combine the foods. If you have been craving something unhealthy, instead of just scribbling it off, try and pair it up with something healthy that would cut down the negative impacts. If chocolate is something you are craving, pair it with a banana or munch on some chocolate chips and almonds instead of delving in a whole lot of the same. Make healthier choices with desserts. If you have been looking out for ways to stop eating too much sugar, it is on you to make healthier choices when it comes to the desserts. Instead of blindly picking up a toothachingly sweet dessert, try and switch it up with a healthier variant of the same, be it yogurt and fruits or even just a healthy bowl of fruit salad instead. Stock up on the fruits. Fruits make up for an amazing replacement for you to look into. It is important to include a good amount of natural sugars in the body because even carbs in this form is essential for the body. So, always ensure that your fridge is stocked with all the essentials. Go cold turkey. If you have been seeking answers on how to stop eating so much sugar, the best and possibly the toughest way to do so is by going cold turkey. Majority of the experts and people who have tried this suggest that the first one two days are hard and might make you feel dizzy and bad all throughout, but it is quite effective in the long run. Avoid sauces. If you want to successfully execute this, it is important to ensure that you avoid sauces as well and not treat them as something that's okay to consume. Just a single tablespoon of tomato ketchup contains 4 grams of sugar in it. Do the rest of the calculations. Dried fruits aren't the best. Majority of the dried fruits tend to be of the fruits which have a high glycemic index, and drying the fruit out further concentrates the sugar concentration in the fruit. That is the last thing one needs to have when it comes to managing their sugar consumption, avoid them for the most part. Manage portions. All of us love indulging in some sugar treats from time to time. It goes without saying that it is not always possible to avoid the cravings and there are possibilities that you will end up giving in to them. That's perfectly okay as well. The only thing that one needs to do is to ensure that you watch out for the portion sizes. Stick to whole foods. 
Start by cutting out the unwanted refined grains in the bread and cheese and stick to the variants that actually do contribute to your health in the long run. Consuming whole grains is actually a good enough option to switch to when you are trying to cut down sugar. Cutting down sugar can do you good. For the most part, cutting down sugar can actually be an amazing way to not just cut down the unwanted calories but also prevent the risks of developing insulin resistance and heart diseases that many often are concerned about. Join our WhatsApp subscription for latest health articles delivered right to your mobile devices. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to keep yourself updated.